hello everyone and welcome back to another adobe Illustrator tutorial so today we are going to create this modern style 3d text effect in adobe Illustrator. so let's start the video first let's remove this text effect and let's type our text the font i'm using for this text effect is quartery font size will be 475 point let's center this to the artboard and click on this none to remove the fill color and let's go to appearance panel here click on this add new fill icon and let's go to gradient panel and let's apply a default black and white gradient let's change the colors click on this point and let's change the color to this one and click on this point and let's change the color to this one next let's change the angle to 90 let's go back to appearance panel and let's duplicate this layer now select this first one and let's go back to gradient panel and click on this point and drag this point around about here now add one point here and let's change the color of this point next click on this point and change the location of this point to 41 percent now select this point and let's change the location of this point to 11 percent next go back to appearance panel and click on this arrow and next we'll apply offset path to this layer effect path and offset path and apply a minus 2 pixel offset path then click ok next we have to apply a transform effect to this layer let's go to effect distort and transform and transform and here in move section let's apply a minus 1.5 pixel for horizontal minus 1.5 pixel for vertical then click ok next select this layer and duplicate this layer select this layer and change the color to white next click on this arrow and let's apply a transform effect to this layer let's go to effect distort and transform and transform and here in move section let's change the values minus 2 pixel for horizontal and keep the vertical to 0 pixel then click ok next let's duplicate this layer now select this layer and let's apply a default gradient and let's change the color click on this point and let's change the color to this one now click on this point let's change the color to this point next go back to appearance panel click on this arrow and let's apply offset path to this layer effect path and offset path and apply a 2 pixel offset path then click ok let's remove the transform effect from this layer next let's duplicate this layer now select this layer and let's change the color of this layer then click ok next click on this arrow and let's apply a transform effect to this layer effect distort and transform and transform and let's change the values like this in scale section we'll apply a 99.9 percent .9 for horizontal 99.9 .9 for vertical and in move section keep the horizontal value 0 and change the vertical value to 0 0.5 pixel and change the copies to 18 then click ok next select this layer and duplicate this layer now change the color of this layer to black next click on this arrow and then click on transform and let's change the copies to 25 then click ok next click on opacity and change the blend mode to multiply change the opacity to 50 percent next select this layer duplicate this layer now select this layer drag this layer to bottom now click on this layer and let's change the color of this layer then click ok click on this arrow 
and click on offset path and let's change the offset path to 10 pixel then click ok next we'll apply a transform effect to this layer let's go to effect distort and transform and transform and here in scale section let's change the value 98.5 percent for horizontal and 99 percent for vertical in move section keep the horizontal value to 0 pixel and let's change the vertical value to 10 pixel then click ok next duplicate this layer now select this layer and let's change the color then click ok next click on this arrow and then click on offset path and let's change the value to 11 pixel then click ok next duplicate this layer now select this layer click on this arrow and let's apply a one more transform effect to this layer let's go to effect distort and transform and transform click on apply new effect and move section keep the horizontal value to 0 pixel and let's apply a 0 0.5 pixel for vertical and let's change the copies to 28 and then click OK next let's duplicate this layer let's duplicate this layer now select this layer and drag this layer to bottom now change the color of this layer to black and click on this arrow let's apply a one more transform effect to this layer let's go to effect distort and transform and transform click on apply new effect here in scale section let's change the values 90 percent for horizontal and keep the vertical to 100 percent in move section keep the horizontal to 0 pixel and change the vertical value to 30 pixel and then click ok next we'll apply a gaussian blur to this layer let's go to effect blur and gaussian blur and let's apply a 8 pixel gaussian blur and then click ok next click on opacity and change the blend mode to multiply now click on this arrow next we'll apply a warp effect to this text effect let's go to effect warp and let's click on arc and let's apply a 14 percent arc effect to this text effect next we'll apply a offset path effect to this whole text effect let's apply a 2 pixel offset path effect to this text effect so here is our final text effect look i hope you have learned something from this video please do like and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching